actually came to Central for State Solo and Ensemble. And that's when I kind of went on my own little walking tour and everyone I passed said hi to me. And so I got that community feel right off the bat. The bat so it was really awesome to feel that and feel like a family and a small community feel as, a big, as opposed to being a small fish in a big pool. So I came here with my entire class in 10th grade and I didn't know what to expect. We just kind of came. So I started looking at schools. Uh, I went to a presentation at my high school um, by a recruiter. Her name is Katrina and she was just going through the PowerPoint and she mentioned that there was an aviation program and I was just like, hey. For my senior project at my high school back in Olympia, um, I ended up researching a university and just kind of writing a paper about it. So I ended up researching Central. I had visited the summer between my junior and senior year and had taken a tour and just like fell in love with it. Um, I looked at honestly just about every college from Seattle to like Bozeman, Montana um, and just looked at all of them and I really wanted to go as far away from my parents as I could. <laughs> and, um, and so actually it was my mom who was like, no, you need to check out Central. Like you, I think you'll really like it. And then started touring schools throughout the area, um, all throughout Washington, toured a school in Nevada, one in Idaho, and toured Central, and a lot went into it, but ended up picking here and have loved it ever since. Never toured it right off the bat when I was in high school. I actually, um, but I did apply to Central, and I, it was the first place I got in. And in high school, I was not the best student. I wasn't bad, but I remember just feeling like I was never gonna get into a college. And when I got my letter from Central, it was such a great feeling to know that I was going to a university, that I ran to town from my house to tell my mom that I got into college. And when I came here, took a tour, um, I fell in love with where I was and I felt extremely comfortable, which for me being an only child and being really close to my mom, it was really a big deal for me to feel like I could live anywhere else besides the small town that I'm from. My process was when I was at my original school on the East Coast, um, I just didn't feel like I fit in. I did a lot of things with the university. I was a student athlete. I was heavily involved in my academics and, um, you know, meeting a lot of people, but I never felt like I had that community that I belonged in. And, um, and also I was paying out of state tuition and my family couldn't afford that. And so it was really bizarre because I couldn't I couldn't um, tour the campus before I came because I was in school full time. And so I committed before I had ever seen the campus or talked to anyone. And uh, I'm really grateful that I made the right decision because uh, when I came on campus, it was, it was for my orientation. Really what made me decide to come here was the um, Wildcat Day, the open house. Um, yeah, that's really it. I just decided I wanted to go here that day. So I went to the admission stand and like accepted um, my, um, what do you call that, an acceptance letter? I don't know, <laughs> accepted my acceptance. So yeah, I just decided that day that I wanted to go here. It just felt like home. It was the only one that I could picture myself like living at and really like, I don't know, um, just feeling like myself here, you know? I really felt at home and like, I could actually picture myself like here on Central's campus, living here and being successful. It was just welcoming. It was nice. Um, everyone here is very welcoming and accepting and just like friendly in general. I knew I was meant to be here. That sounds so cheesy, but yeah, um, it just felt like home. Even though I hadn't, I knew nothing really about the university and hadn't seen the whole thing, I'd just seen a couple moments of it, it definitely like had that feeling of, yeah, I'm meant to be here. This is meant to be my home for the next couple years. My mom was super cliche. It was just like, you left the campus with stars in your eyes and we knew that you were going to come here. And I was like, that's super dramatic, but okay. And, but then when I got on campus, it was just a different feel than anything else I'd ever like seen or felt on another campus. But I've always, I've always felt like I was at home here. And so I'm really happy that I made the right decision. I loved it. I fell in love pretty right out of the gate when I started talking about small class sizes and I got a proper look at the campus. It was just, it clicked for me. Central's the place to go. You go there and you immediately feel welcomed. 
Um, my story probably isn't that unique, but I think it's kind of interesting. Uh, I didn't want to go to any schools in Washington at all because I live in Washington. And I was like, no, I'm going to go really far away. And I told my parents and they were like, no. So, uh, so my parents convinced me to come. I went on a campus tour and I just fell in love with the campus. It was so beautiful. And my tour guide actually did a great job. It's actually, um, I wanted to become a tour guide. She made me want to do that. So. Yeah, I just learned a lot about the campus and I really liked it. And so after that, I was just kind of hooked. And then um, because of GPA requirements, I had automatic admissions. And so I was really happy about that. Um, I visited Central and I walked onto the campus and everyone talks about the like feeling you get when you like walk onto the campus you're supposed to be at. And I had that feeling and I was like, wow, I didn't actually think that feeling existed. Um, so I had that feeling along with, I just loved how like, the community feel of it because it's not too big but it's not too small either so it's like a perfect medium.